welcome back to the video. Today we will be playing Sea of Thieves. Ski he. Ski ye. Uh, yeah, so. Is this. No, that's that's not what I'm talking about. Uh, uh, yeah, guys, so today we're gonna be playing Sea of Thieves. Sea of Thieves premiere live stream thing. I'm. I'm working up the courage to do an actual live stream, okay, guys? I, I don't wanna have to do a live stream because I don't want something to happen where, like. I don't know, like, somebody yells out to me and is like, yo, can you go do this? And then I'm like, why? And then I just get, like, and then I have to end the stream and then it's kind of awkward. So that's why, guys, uh, I'm going to do premieres. Um, but I will do, I will do one. Um, one sec. Now, guys, like, this is kind of raging, uh, but my dog has her chew toy again, so she's going to be putting that behind the couch, um, so I might have to take a couple, like, goodbye every now and again, but it's fine. So we're trying to uh, get Pirate Legend, so basically what Pirate Legend is, is hitting level 50 in three different trading companies, so um, I've chosen Order of Souls, Gold Hoarders and Merchant Alliance, and then you're supposed to, well, I think at least you're supposed to, uh, talk to this guy, and he gives you a shanty. Dice. There's a die in his eye. Um, and then you go here, th these little things, and you play any instrument, so let's just say this, and you play that certain shanty that he gives you, and this lights up and turns into the Reaper, the, not Reapers. Uh, Athena's Fortune Hideout, Pirate Legend Hideout. So that's what we're gonna do. But I gotta do Gold Hoarders. So kind of scared. Because haven't did Gold Hoarders in a long time. Cause like I'm, I'm still working towards. I'm level 48 in Gold Hoarders. Uh, let's just gather some stuff. Most like serious Sea of Thieves players take like an hour to just like pick all of the pick up all the stuff. Uh, if you're excited for this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Um, should I take the grubs just for PvP purposes? Get a ship over here. Like, should I? I feel like I should. Sovereign figurehead. Yeah, let's let's go like all gold and gilded. Actually, no, let's just go normal, normal like dark and gritty. I guess. No, no, no. I don't know, what should we do, guys? Let's go for, like, let's just go parrot, 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 parrot. Wow, I've said parrot a lot so far. Um, yeah. So, I got, I got a couple of new things. I got this thing called the Ashen Curse. Uh, I, I'm rocking it right now. It's really, it's really easy to get. It's actually called the Noob Curse because it's super easy to get. So I'm kind of scared that, like, maybe people aren't taking me seriously because I have this Noob Curse on. Um, I'll, sh I'll sh try to show you guys, uh, what, how to get that soon. Um, maybe one day. Um, I'm taking away all Raid Voyages. Raid Voyages just aren't, well, actually, sorry, just Raid Voyages. I'm not doing, like, Buried Treasure, Riddles. Treasure vaults. Riddles are fun, but I don't really like them, so just like not treasure vaults, medallies, raid boards, just actually. Actually. So there's this guy named Starblazer J. Shout out to him. He uh, does like exploit videos. He did a gold hoarder exploit, and so here's what you're supposed to do you're supposed to go to the Wild Rose Tall Tale, start the Tall Tale dive for the tall tail so let's dive for that actually i'm gonna get a snowy or derek i don't think you guys met derek before so i'm gonna take out no sorry snowy not you today derek 
I might switch to Snowy later on in the stream. Yeah, so this is Derek, everybody. He's my monkey. Um, yeah, there's been, well, I haven't uploaded in a while, so there's a lot of new things that I've been uh, doing. First of all, I was, I remember I was so excited for the throwing knives. I was like, oh my god, I'm so hyped for throwing knives. That's like all I'm going to use. I used them once. I used them once just because I wanted to do the, uh, that Sea Thieves new season vibe video thing. That's all I did. And then I think I used it once doing PvP because I was like, hey, why not? Maybe they're really good. They suck. So let's go. Let's dive under the water. So this is going to put us at Sanctuary Outpost. I think Sanctuary Outpost. I don't know. But so this is what is called a Gold Hoarder's Exploit. So you guys have heard of exploits probably. What's really scary is that uh, there's this guy named Lucky. He does see these videos. Shout out to him too. Um, He said... He doesn't like doing exploits because they're cheating. So I'm scared. Like, am I going to get banned for doing this? D can you get banned for doing this? Like, where? Where? If you're watching this, please don't ban me. It's my favorite game. And also, just, I like this game. Please don't ban me. I don't think I'm going to get banned for doing this. I don't know if exploits are bad. Hopefully they're not. Plus, nobody's going to go and ban a, a little kid, I guess. Uh, so west. So we gotta go to Rapier, Reapier. We're gonna go for Rapier K. Wait, Reapier K? Rapier? Right, Rapier. Okay. So, wait. Southwest. No. No, I'm not. I'm not going to speak with Madam Olive. Oh, Southwest. We're going Southwest. Yep, that's perfect. Now what we want to do is we want to cancel the voyage. Because that was just so we can teleport. Go west a little bit. This should be like the closest tiny baby island. Oh, it's right there. So now what we're supposed to do, a little bit of tutorial for you guys, um, I, I don't take any credit for showing you guys this, this is all from StarBlazerJ. He just hit 100 subscribers, uh, my sub goal is 20 subscribers, so guys, right now, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel and we can get there, we're at 16, 16 subscribers, 18, I'm pretty sure it's 16, I'm gonna go with that. Um, we have 16 subscribers. Let's let's get to 20, guys. Sub goal: 20 subscribers. I think you actually no, that's for 500 subscribers. That's like your like, I guess like your starter one. That's like, yo, here's what it's going to be like when you get a thousand. But yeah, guys. So far, thank you guys so much for 16 subscribers. Um, because really, like. When I started, I was expecting maybe to get maybe like two or three subscribers in a year. I've gotten 16 subscribers, so it's a lot more than I've expected. So thank you guys a lot. Here's a little parking tip for y'all. Is this, yeah, this is right here. Okay. So we're supposed to go here, and here's how you do it. So you lower the anchor. This is probably a terrible place to do it, though. So far away. So, what you want to do is you want to raise your sails. Um. Then you want to raise your anchor. And then you won't move. You have to lower your anchor, then raise your sails. Then raise your anchor. And you shouldn't move unless you are turning. Unless your wheels are turned. So, you have to straighten out. Wait. You have to straight, straighten out. Perfect. So now you shouldn't move at all. So then if there is a ship coming towards you, you can you can just raise, uh, lower your sails, and then you're like, nah, bye. 
um, peace, basically. Um, now, I mean, obviously, um, there's some, like, tactics where you just don't lower your, um, anchor or, uh, raise your sails at all. Um, oh, 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 no, no, no. Sorry about that, guys. I'm getting shot at. Bro, I don't want to leak my dog's name because I'm afraid that, like, it's bad. It's not good. I'm going to die. I hate phantoms so much. Don't you dare shoot me. Ow. Give me whatever is in here. I have heals. What am I, what am I doing? Die. Ow. I just healed, dude. What do you want from him? Fine. Blam. Die. Bro, it's not even nighttime. Yeah, I'm dead. Like, it's not even nighttime. Why are you here? Should I take the lantern, please? I'm not going to, because I don't. I'm not doing the floor damage. Boom! I suppose you can just keep farming for the dams because you can get like five friends. I think there's only wait four friends. So I'm pretty sure that's how much uh, how many flames there are. Just get them to all light one flame each, and then you can just keep like stacking for the dams. No. You suck. I can dodge you. And then you just, like, run. I'm at a disadvantage here. I hate the ones with blunderbuffs because they're so good. Yeah, take that. Bro, I just want them to leave so I can get on with the exploit. None of them gave me gold pouches. Out of all of them, none of them gave me gold pouches. Thanks. Okay, so, um, one important part I forgot to uh, say. You gotta start a quest. So, the quest is, well, voyage. That's what the cool kids call it. Captain's Treasure Vault. I, wait, it is sail. You have to sail for it. And it should, yeah, okay, so it's pointing towards Rapier K, so it's on this island. So you're supposed to go on this island because apparently it chooses this island for the first thing every time. So then you have to dig up the treasure, so follow the, the shaky shake. And then when it starts spinning around, it's not really pointing anywhere. Oh, last two, two fans. Okay, so now you use this and follow it until, until it starts spinning like that. Dig right where that starts. Now some skeletons should pop up. And you're supposed to kill them. And, I think this one, ah, oh, here we go. They should drop vestiges of power. So, you can do this one with Devil's Roar, but with Flame's End. So, that one's pretty fun. Um, yeah, oh, wait. Anyway, guys, yeah, um, did you... Only one? Oh no, two. One or two. Just one, eh? Okay, that's fine. Yeah, they should drop vestiges of power. Um, and that's the exploit. They just drop vestiges of power, and you just keep doing that over and over again until um, <sighs> excuse me, guys, until you feel like um, yeah. So, uh, you got enough. 
Uh, I'm just gonna do one or two. Should I do multiple? I'm gonna do multiple. We got time here to live stream, kind of. Um, yeah, sail. Actually, is this the right island or do I have to cancel it? Okay, so it's not this island. It should start vibrating right away. Um. Now, if it, yeah, if it's, if it does, um, if it doesn't start vibrating towards this island. I hate it when that happens. Anyway, yeah, you just, you stop the mission, you cancel the mission, and then you do it all over again, I guess. Boom. Okay, let's see where this thing is. Oh, it's in this area. It's right here. That's two at once. Never mind, I'm just kidding. Did any of them drop vestiges? None of them drop vestiges! Yeah, some of them, sometimes it might not. Sometimes it's the random selection of spawn, I guess. I don't know where this came from. So, yeah, this is how you farm ammo pouches. You just get them to spawn, and then they just drop ammo pouches. I kind of want to pouch, though. Oh, okay. Die. Bro, Derek, look, I just left Derek in there. Can they just, like, stop spawning? What island is this? I'm assuming Cannon Cove. It looks like Cannon Cove. Huh? Okay, I'm gonna do a C4. After selling this, of course. Oh yeah, another trick. If somebody tries like harpooning your ship to board you, uh, get your sniper out. So if you shoot it, if you shoot your harpoon, and somebody else's harpoon, it does that. It like basically cancels it. And if you slice it, now you can't slice the uh, harpoon itself. You have to slice like the dispenser, the, the, the harpoon dispenser. That's what it's called. Uh, so, yeah, let's just go, I'm assuming this one's probably closer, because, yeah. Uh, then we'll do a C4, just because C4s are fun. Aren't they? They're so much fun. Yay! I don't know what, do not know what that is, sorry. So now that we're going that way, um, I guess we can take off rapier, okay? Um, I only got one. This is, that's how sad my, uh, my videos are. Like, I remember back when I didn't know that you could do missions from the quest table like this. And I legit, some people, like, I, I remember, um, I showed my friend my videos and they're like, Dude, what are you doing? They, they were just like, dude, what are you doing? I'm like, um, playing Sea of Thieves? What's wrong with this video? And you're like, dude, you're not doing any missions. Yeah, because I don't want to have to buy them. And and then they're like, you don't have to buy missions anymore. I'm like, what? You don't? You can just do them for free? Like, I mean, I, I don't know how else I'm going to say that. Like, it's true. I used to think that you had to still buy missions. And I just basically did island hopping for the entire time of my uh, life. Like, do you guys remember that problem? If you're if you're new to this channel, subscribe. But if you're old to this channel, you know, I uh, 
I used to do that. I used to just go to random islands, and this was the quality of loot. I'd be like, I have so much loot. I have two treasures. I have a vestige of power. And, like, a skull. Maybe. Rarely. So let's just sell this. Here you go, good sir. 1,000. We didn't get enough rep. Oh, yeah, I have a million gold now. I forgot to tell you guys. Um. Wow, that was almost, uh, that almost, um, helped us hit level, uh, 48. Wait, 49. Okay, time to do... Wait, no. Did I surface? Okay, no, I, I didn't. Wow, okay, so... A uh, raid voyage, C4, because why not? Okay, let's go, guys! Oh. Just had to do a quick thing. I've always thought about this. Why do I, um, why do I never upload? It's like, all I'm doing, uh, all I'm doing differently is talking while I'm gaming. Like, this is basically what I would be doing if I was playing not so uh yeah boom okay so let's uh so yeah c4 love c4 it's really 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 fun Ooh, there's a shipwreck there though not all gold hoarder loot therefore it sucks so uh, yeah, let's raise our grog after hitting Pirate Legend 2. Actually, guys, so I have 518 ancient coins, and here's the funny thing. There are ancient coin skeletons, which, well, it's really cool what ancient coin skeletons do. Is they, They're really rare. Somehow I managed to find two. Oh my god, there's this weird glitch where the water just stops moving and the animation of the boat breaks, basically. And what the animation does is it's where when I should be going upwards, where my ship should be going like over a wave, it goes down. So that might happen and that might be really annoying. So actually, um, I was trying to record, but then it was super laggy. It's not laggy this time, which is nice. But my game kept crashing. My game kept crashing over and over again. And I was like, okay, my game keep cra keeps crashing and it's laggy, so I can't do anything. And it was a PvP. Yeah, like right now my ship is going up. Well, the glitch would make my ship go down instead of up. Okay, let's just hope that it doesn't hit my wheel. I remember I, I did that. I did a mission with my, I did a C4 with my friend, sorry. First, first like five seconds, we uh, both into that and we die. And uh, the first cannonball hit our ship directly. It hit our ship directly in the wheel. It's like we just started and now we have to repair our wheel. That happened to me uh, playing, uh, doing PVP too. First thing, one bolt. First, first cannonball uh, fired at me. One bolt. And these guys were uh, with the sailor stuff. That all like new stuff. Don't crash, please. Of course. I just said don't crash, and you crash. Nah, I love doing that because it's just like, um, it's just like healing a band-aid. Let's, uh, boy. Let's raise the sails just because. So, uh, you do need the pistol because it one-shots, uh, buckaroos, like phantoms. Actually, no. Double barrel pistols are better because they do the same amount of damage as a normal pistol to phantoms. They one-shot them. But there's double... First of all, it has more ammo, I think. 
and two, it does more, uh, it's quicker, so I can take out two at once. I don't, okay, I got, I, I love, I love that about this game, is that I can get renown, so levels, I can level up, from just, like, climbing a ladder, or something else. No. Double ones to the face as we load. I'm happy that they made the, uh... No! No! Okay. Bro. I'm happy that they made this uh, way better. Because I like the double barrel pistol now. It's actually good. I don't know what I'm going to call this. I, might, I feel like I'm just going to call it, like live stream just, just, I'm just that's what i'm gonna call it. i'm just gonna call it live stream hello wow that failed i duh, i hate doing pv um pve sorry because they practically hack like whenever they smack me i like it causes me to stop whatever i'm doing but no when when I sl smack them, they can still smack me. It's like I can't do that to you. I always say smack and slice, when slicing us all. Okay, so okay, that's a lot of uh, buckaroos. Yeah, guys, phantoms are now specified under the name of buckaroos. Hello, buckaroo. I noticed that they don't actually have to do the blocking animation to block. They can just be like, oh, I'm getting uh, sliced at. I can just, uh, I can just hack the system because they're a part of the system. I've ever used this tactic and they actually come out of the thing oh no my dog put when she doesn't put it uh, behind the couch behind my couch she puts it under the couch so I still have to get up and get it further oh I'm a dead eye I'm an absolute dead eye I legit just did like a flick trick shot thing Where are ye? Where are ye, scallywags? Or as I like to call them, buckaroos! Nah, what the hell just happened? Yo, where? Double tap! I call this the double tap pistol because it like, it's like a double tap tap. You just like, well, I'll show you here. Double tap, tap. Okay, never mind. If that hit him, it would be another tap. And that's why I call it the double tap tap. Double tap. And then, where's the lucky guy that gets my last bullet? Oh god. Yo guys, I'm gonna die, but I don't care. I'm gonna, I'm going to probably die if I stay here, so I'm going to have to go onto my ship to do this. So I'll see you, I'll see you in a sec guys, I gotta go get my, okay, never mind. She got it out. Um, yo, I don't see anything, guys. I don't see anybody. Make sure to subscribe, though. Make sure to subscribe, and um, I, I get a rocket launcher. I get a rocket launcher to take down these buckaroos. <laughs> what? I'm still reloading? Double tap, tap! I did the double tap. I did the double tap, guys. Are you proud of me, guys? You gotta subscribe for this. You gotta subscribe for that. I love how in video games, it's like, I didn't just reload, but, um, like, I put the bullets in the gun, but then because I didn't do the full reload animation, I have to put them in again. 
I gotta do the perfect double tap tap. Double tap, tap. Let's go. Double tap. Nah, is that like? Am I gonna be saying that the entire stream? Just being like, oh, boss. When it changes music like that, it's double. It's uh, I just said it's double tap time. It's double uh, double uh, it's boss time. This is what I do. I just, oh, don't slice me, please, or shoot me. They do. Where? I just know. I just want to know where the boss is. Boss. No, they all have guns. I don't need guns. Ah. Yep, that works. It one shots them. It's so good. It one shots them, but I'm so bad at doing it. It just kills me. Bro, that was the quickest. That was the quickest thing ever. Um, okay, let's, um, so treasure is going to, um, you guys probably know how it is. The treasure comes where, like, it's kind of where I am. I need to, I hate that I do it so quickly, though, because now I have to, like, go up to the top floor to get this thing. Wait, it's like down here, right? Wait, no, no, it's out here. I lit it, and then it's right here. Yeah, it's right here. Can you sell the fortress treasury key? Let me know in the comments below if you know. Boom. Bam. Yo, look at all this gold. So I always take pick up the gold first. You guys don't need to do that, but. Um, yeah, I have a million gold now, so don't know if, I'm not going to spend it on anything yet. I want the entire Dark Adventurer set, but if you guys don't know, that's 49 million, so not, not going to be able to do that, uh, anytime soon. And I also need to become Pirate Legend to get that. Ooh, gold bars. Um, so really, right now, I don't care about gold, like, at all, like, if you told me that, like, right now, for the entire time of me trying to become Pirate Legend, I can get as much reputation as I want, but I, I can't earn any gold for it, I would say, yeah, sure. Because I don't care about gold. I just care about um, selling and getting reputation. Because that's, I don't need to get, um, I don't need to get a certain amount of gold. I need to get a certain amount of reputation. So this will hit me up to level 49. And then I'll do a skeleton fort and then I should become a uh, gold hoarder. And then I think I might end the stream. I don't think I'm gonna end the stream there. I'm going to like, well, first of all, what time is it? Like, yo, whoa, whoa, whoa. Can I, am I allowed to do this? It's 426, okay. So I said that I will end the stream at five o'clock. I didn't actually say this. I said this to myself. I'll end the stream at five o'clock. So, the stream's almost over. Boom. I'm gonna lower the thing one more time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a lot of pirate legends out there. Look, I've played with a lot of pirate legends. Because the open crew thing where you can just, like, just join a random person's crew. Oh, no, I'm stuck. Guys, I'm stuck. What have I done? Um. Guys. Guys. What have I done? What have I, what have I done? Oh, great. Do I have it? Do I have fire? Okay, good idea. But I'm in the water, so I'm just going to cool that thing off. I was planning on having to kill myself. I wish there was a respawn tactic. Um, I guess I could just drown myself. Guys, I'm 
just gonna have to face it. I'm gonna have to drown myself. Unless I try, unless I find a way to get out. What have I done? I've glitched through like all the rock and stuff. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to, I'm drowning now, I think. Okay, I'm starting to die. Bro! Nah. When you have to kill yourself in a video game so you can get some treasure. It sounds bad if you don't know the situation. It's like, if you're playing a game where you have to kill yourself to get treasure, it sounds, it sounds bad, but... Wait, sorry, I'm aliving myself. I'm not allowed to say that on YouTube. Okay, there we go. Don't worry, guys. It had to be done or else I would be stuck inside of a wall forever. Now, it would be smart if, like, I had a friend with me. I could just... They've added cannon fire to the ship, to the ship sounds. Is there water in here? I just heard water. And what's nice is that since my anchor's raised, I can easily do this without having to do what I used to have to do, where if a situation like this happened, I had to like go through all that stuff where I had to like, <laughs> I had to, do things basically i had to like i had to like turn my ship around a bunch of times and then i didn't turn it around quick enough and then it like then i had to like raise the anchor again this time i just do i just do that so let's oh there's treasure though or wait no that's ammo No, that's gold. Um, don't know how we got that. Don't know how that happened, but it's gold. So let's just not glitch through the wall this time. There's a gold pouch right there. I never knew that you could get gold pouches uh, at Sea Corps, just li lying around like that. Okay, two, wait, what right am I? I'm grade three already. Two galleons grave and outpost. S. No, I do that a lot where I'm like, okay, we gotta go S. You mean south? Yeah. I'm not on captain ship, so I can't use sovereigns. I really wish I could use sovereigns, but I can't. Guys, that's one, that's the best part about um, having a captain ship is you can use sovereigns. The sovereigns are basically the reaper's hideout for where you actually you still get the reputation for each trading company, not just the reapers. Now they do have their own episode. So. But yeah, guys, shout, shout out to uh, sovereigns. <laughs> sovereigns are something. So let's see what we got. So we got. I'm not even looking why am I saying so we got. So we got um one, two, three captain's chests, uh two sailor's chests, and a treasure chest with two cradles of virtues. So captain chest will go here, sailor's chest will go there, and uh treasure chest will go there for now. Um, always, always do that, guys. Always, um, have your treasure sorted. Now, if, like I said, if you're sovereigns, if you're doing sovereigns, um, so captain ship, keep them all together. Keep them, like, right up here, all together, so then you can just harpoon it, um, really easy, uh, to the sovereigns, and then just, 
sell all of it. But basically, so I know, like, uh, okay, I'm going to do captain's chests second after I sell the sailor's chests or something. Who thought it was a good idea to build an outpost on loads of rocks? Let's just say the helmsman is half blind. No. But, like, seriously, though, it's a dumb idea, because, like, what if you accidentally crash into one of those? It's the one, one outpost where you can actually die. Actually, no, Mars Peak, you can die in. I'm still going to the Sovereigns. I'm not going to do Sovereigns, because I don't have any more. More? Why are you doing this? No, I mean, I guess it doesn't hurt to park here, because then it can be like, ha, 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 I can do Sovereigns, because I got a captain. Uncoil. That works. Okay, I'm going to do sailor chest first. Here's the thing, guys. Um, captain's treasure. No, yeah, captain's treasure. Um, buried treasure missions. If you're wanting to do treasure missions, they're longer, and they have less value. Always do pirate treasure maps because, first of all, they're quicker. They're on a small island, so easier to dig up. Sure, it's only two, but look. Keep that in mind, sailor, sa I just sold a sailor's chest. It's 1,000 gold without the emissary. Um, Yeah, it's 1,000 gold without the emissary. We hit level 49, baby, let's go. Um, And now I'm gonna sell a captain's chest. And so what a captain's treasure map does is it gives you uh captain's chests. Well, yeah, you do just a pirate, pirate's one, which is quicker. You get a thousand, but with a captain's chest, so captain's pirate uh, treasure map. It's only nine hundred, so you're still, um, you're getting less w for captain's chests uh, than a sailor's chest. So kind of crazy, guys. Kind of crazy. So, uh, always do sa sailor's chests are more valuable than captain's chests. Now, obviously, <coughs> they could be worth more than sailor's chests in uh, a higher qual uh, quantity. But, sailor's chests only need two, and they can be 2,000. Remember, guys, you can... It takes really long... Um, rather hard or long you want a hard one to get um a like one treasure that's worth a lot or a really long mission that gives you a uh, small a lot of smaller treasures that are in a higher value in a higher quantity guys one more level that's all we need we need one more level and we're leveling up to level 50 and we can do merchants guys merchant alliance that's that's gonna be the hardest because merchant alliance uh no matter what you sell you still only get like a tiny little sliver of uh reputation just like if you sell uh yeah like that you get that much for like 50 different treasures but i think skeleton forts would be the best for that Yeah, I can fall in the water if I want to. Excuse me, game? I picked that up. Oh, yeah, guys. Trick. So, uh, I don't suggest starting by doing this. I suck at it, too. So, like, running and then dropping your treasure. So, you can basically run with your treasure. Oh, my God. Can you just pick up the damn chest? Whatever, man. You drop it, you run, and then you can just click X, and then you can move away, and you'll still pick it up. So you're supposed to drop it, run, uh, after you click X, and it should you should pick it up. So it's basically like speed, running, holding treasure, something like that. <laughs> we almost did it, guys. Is 
blasting Captain's chest. But yeah, I suggest you do this. Never, never mind. I can't. I can't even do it. I suggest you. No, guys. I don't want to have to show my screen like this. This is scary. I don't want to show. I don't want to show my my screen because it's like I don't want to do this. I'll just like blur out the background. I'll just put it. I'll just slap a black screen down. Four forty, guys. Like I said, stream will end at five o'clock. I just realized this is a premiere. I'm recording this, so that means that it's not ending at four o'clock. It's like starting at five. It's not ending at five o'clock. Sorry, it's starting at five o'clock. Because that's when I'll be able to edit it and, like, post it. We're not going to do any editing just so I can, like, people that don't know that premieres are actually live, um, are actually pre-recorded live streams. <coughs> uh, yeah, I'll do no editing until I'm like, this is totally a live stream. So, thankfully, I can sell that last chest because I can just do this. I, I, I can just do this this yeah do you want to rejoin your previous session yes so that's why i like i think that see if he's actually did this because it's such a big game and it has so many uh it's like a thousand gigabytes for like one small update it's like a thousand gigabytes oh this must be a huge update sees the update it's like they added like one or two really small things to the pirate emporium <laughs> But look, still, don't sell to the pirate. Like, just, just seriously, though. Like, did I just say don't sell to the pirate emporium? What? But yeah, guys, this I I like that you don't have to. Um... Yep, that's fine with me. Um, I love how you don't have to worry about stuff like that. Now, sometimes when I'm holding treasure. Yeah. That's what I thought. Sometimes when I'm holding treasure and my game crashes. I remember one time. I hate this. But I had an Ashen Windstorm. It's actually gone. I had an Ashen Windstorm. My game crashed. I was like, okay, I don't really care. I came back. Oh, is that a birthday? That's a birthday candle. Anyway, I came back, thinking, well, that's fine. And then I see, where's my skull? Where's my Ash and Wind skull? And then I'm like, I think we legit lost it. I think it despawned it. And then five, like, five minutes later, we're sailing in the middle of the ocean. And I see it in the water. It spawned my skull in the middle of the ocean it's actually what i did can i just can i talk to this Go lady on, and buy me. a level i could if i want. adventure calls i guess it does seriously though where's my where where's my chest it was right here and now it's gone like i said we could just it could have spawned in the ocean it doesn't really matter where it went. It's not really anything major. Um. So we're almost, I would say, doing a skeleton fort would give us the stuff that we needed. The, the stuff that we need to hit level 50. What do you guys think? What would be... I'm gonna do a captain's treasure map just because. 
Crook's hollow. I don't care. It's all in the sand. I'm lucky. I'm lucky that we just got one in the sand because that's what it's gonna be. My anchor is not even low, low raised. Yeah, my anchor is not even raised. Okay, let's die for this thing. Sorry, chest. Uh, I'll, hopefully, I'll see it in the middle of the ocean. Right, I forgot to do that. I love it when there's a ship nearby. And he's like chasing me, and then I just, I say, I die, and then I'm like, peace. Now, that's the thing. You do have to be a certain uh, radius away from the uh, ship to actually dive, or else it'll be like, no, you can't dive because it's scary. That is cheating or something. Oh, it's a captain ship. Hell Drive. Captain by Atoll Drop pledged to, to, to sea dive. I'm diving in the sea, so am I pledging to the sea divers? That's his guild. I don't know how to get the guild emote. How, like, it's where you can, like, go to up to, go to up, yep. Go up to different pirates, and then you can, like, other players, basically, and do that emote, and they can, like, it's, like, a basically a guild invite. I don't know what guilds do. I have, they, jester's head that's my um guild but i have no idea what is what is it like what is it called like what does it do sorry i guess you can have the guild emissary that's it that's that's the only thing i know that you can have is you can have a guild emissary we're heading up on like i always noticed it it looks like a uh, like an old 1850 um baseball glove or another thing because guys new tri trivia yeah that's no nah, not trivia like just basically something crazy gloves used to legit just be like a, a normal like bike glove that's legit what we used to wear to protect ourselves from things. That's two gunpowder barrels at once. That's some Storm Merchant Alliance stuff that I don't care about. How do I take damage? How do you take damage from that? So it's by here. It's like by, it's by here. It should be right there, but it's not. Exactly. It seems really hard to do it. It's by the rock. I'm by the rock. Is it right here? What? Actually, I know. It's like... Go onto the dock. And it's like... Right by the three trees. It's like right in here by the three trees. There it is. It's not even Captain's chest, it's Sea, it's sea Master's chest. Is, is this a Sea Master's chest? Wait. No, not Phantoms. I just fought loads of you guys. I just did a sea fort. I just did an insane amount. I just killed an insane amount of you guys. I don't need more. Dogs playing with my cat. Yeah, it's a sea master's chest. I love these things. That's a skelly cap. Do I want to do that? Do I want to take that guy down? I don't know if I do because I'm not feeling skelly cap. When you have the choice to not feel like, oh, it's a store. Never mind. I was like, oh, it's a storage crate, but no, it's not a storage crate. No, it's never a storage crate. I just want, I just want a storage crate. That's all I've wanted for a really long time is just a storage crate. I can never get a storage crate. Where are the tiny baby ro No. Is this the curve? That's the curve at the top, so. It's like, right here, grass patch. 
inward over here by the tree no by like right right around here oh this time actually well guys the stream's almost over so yeah so they're not even captain's chests they're seamaster's chests so I misjudged this. Do captain's treasure maps. They're way better to do. Seamaster's chests are way better. I thought they were just captain's chests. Yeah, captain's chests suck. Do captain's treasure maps. Though. Don't know how I'm going to get these onto the ship. So now this one's behind the second rock. It's behind a rock that's behind the second rock on the curve. It's kind of funny to think. That's how people talk in their minds. Like, you might not understand what I'm saying. You might think I hit my head. But no. To me, that makes sense. I am... It's around the curve. It's, it's on the second rock. Be, it's behind the rock that's behind the second rock on the curve. Yeah, I mean, I okay, I don't even have the map anymore. It's the curve where those two treasures were. It's behind this rock, which was behind the rock on this side, which I'm going to call the second rock on the curve. You guys probably still think I have hit my head. Like at the beginning of the stream, I legit said, ow, I just smacked myself in the face. And you're like, did you get a concussion from smacking yourself in the face? I mean, maybe. I mean, maybe. So let's uh, get these onto our ship and sell these before 5 o'clock. Um, now, I mean, if I go a little over time, it's fine. Everybody likes a little, a little bit more uh, video than expected. Boop. Yeah, so here's how you do it. Drop it, run. It's really hard to do. It's, it's a really hard technique. But pros can do it, I can do it. So, uh, that section that I'm placing the Seamaster chests in are gonna be where the Seamaster chests go and where all my chests go because that's, the, that's my only chest. Do my only chest. I just realized why um why do gold do, do the chests have gold in them? Like I think so. I think so. I don't remember. I really don't remember. Okay, so now that that's done, where is the closest outpost? West south. Yep, that's that's smart. Southwest, I mean. Southwest. Should I bury that? I'm just gonna bury that just because. I'm that I'm that guy. That buries. Well I mean I guess we can have it for later. So I'll bury it here just so it's a little bit harder for um, people to get it. I become a oh actually I'll take this robo. Why is the water turned black? I saw this really stupid video of this really stupid joke. It was so bad. I'm not gonna tell I'm not going to say the name of this channel because I don't even remember it myself. But this guy, supposedly, saw the Kraken dancing on an island in Sea of Thieves. I'm like, nah. People gotta have some, like, because they gotta be really, really gullible to think that that's true. Like, 
Wait, 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 wait. Oh, what's that? It's a message in a bottle. I don't want that. I do not want that. Well, what did I just do? What did I just do? There's like a little message? No. It's like a speech bubble on top of my screen. What is that? Guys, do you... Excuse me? Right, I forgot Kurt's Hollow does this. Or is that an actual ship? Is that an actual guy? No, no, you can you can see it's a skeleton. <laughs> wow. They just I guess they don't like people being on the island. Okay guys. Wait, what? Oh, that's that. So I see plunder outpost. -y. This should hit us. Uh, this should hit us on uh, level 50. Please don't wait. Oh, I actually bought this spyglass with um, ancient coins from the ancient coins shop. No? Pirate Emporium. I was just talking about it, so yeah. Pirate Emporium, that's where I got this from. I think you can still get it now. Let me see. It's called the Ravenwood Spyglass. Um... I think it's in Pirates. I don't think it's here. Tiny tree. Um, what? I don't remember where it is, sorry guys, but. Ravenwood Spyglass, here it is. A steadfast spyglass for whose work involves watching their targets from a distant perch. Yeah, that's, um, that's where it is. Um, you know what? I'm just feeling it. I'm going to switch to a sniper. Um, don't know why. Just have a random feeling about it. That's one good thing about a galleon is that you can have uh, one guy with like the sniper. That's like, oh, is there? Is that a guy in the water? Lamb to the face. And then there's the one guy that's is like, oh, there's a guy here. What's their blunderbuss when he gets ready? Nah. So that's me. I'm a sailor sloop. Wait. Solo sloop? Okay, listen. I did kind of just want to show off my, uh, my new, uh, eye reach. Sniper. I call it a sniper. It's called an eye reach. Do I care that I say it wrong? Not, not, not at all. Not at all. Is the ship already here? Is the... Is the guy that we just saw... Out of my glorious ra Ravenwood spyglass. Did, did he, is he here? Wait, why do I? I just realized. I am using the parrot blunders. And I have parrot clothes. Sorry, not parrot clothes. I have parrot, uh, Wait, that actually did something? I thought that that was just, um, it making the, like, warning sounds, I guess. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for this. Now, I, I will go for all, like, gold and even get the gold hoarder's, uh, clothes on for you guys, uh, if we don't hit level 50 today. No, no, just kidding. I'm going to do, uh, that for Merchant Alliance for you guys, just because. And actually, I'm going to lower my emissary just so I get a little bit more reputation. So I I could hit level 50 even if this doesn't give us level 50. But yeah, guys. Um, so I'm just going to sign off after this because I'm not going to do anything else. Um, so if you got if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Um, this was our first Sea of Thieves live stream slash premiere. <coughs> um. Let's hope that we actually hit an hour for this stream. Um, I'm not going to hit level 50 with this, no. But yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I really enjoyed making this because this was my uh, first first real Sea of Thieves live stream. We did a Fall Guys live stream before. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, thoughts on my new um, threads, I guess. My new, my new uh, setup. 
I guess. Yeah, I got the Ashen Curse, the bandit thing. The, fa the face mask, I guess. Um, <laughs> and yeah. So, let's lower the Emissary if we hit level 50 with this. So, we only were grade 3, so a thousand. Uh, you get, yeah, guys, when you have the Emissary up, lower it when you're, so when you're turning it off. Don't just be like, okay, peace, and then you just, like, just click power off. Lower it, and then you should get reputa a little bit of reputation, jeez. And then you should get uh, some gold, too. <coughs> so, guys, I'll see you in the next video. I'm just going to have a little bit of drink. Now, what's actually kind of funny is you, you can do this, and you can actually tell that you're drunk. You can tell the screen goes weird when you drink. I'm, I'm legit burping. And when you make that sound, it means you're drunk. I'm legit drunk from taking like one or two sips. Yeah? Who's next? Now it's too close to Yeah, this is, uh, don't do this. Don't do this, actually, guys. This is really bad for you. But I'm just doing it because it's a game and nobody's going to get Great. hurt for doing this. Detox drinking spot. ZZ Detox ZZ drinking spot. This pirate drank so much and see these almost became a desert? Dessert? What? What's up? Do you have business with me? Yeah, this is the guy. Haven't you got treasure to find? He's actually a pirate legend. He's a ghost. Ah, we meet again. That's why uh, he's wavy. No, it's because I'm that drunk. Uh, anyway, yeah, guys. Um, I'll see you in the next video. I can't do an emote, but I would do the wave emote. Goodbye!